Go in. You put your hands in the shirt. Oh, yeah. oh my god. <laughs> she said, okay, go in. Now we are going to call get a back massage. Hey guys, it's Zoe. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an everyday makeup look. I decided to change it up a little bit. So if you want to see this video, then keep watching. So I'm going to start with my foundation, <laughs> which, <laughs> which is on the left side. You twist it. We are going to apply it to my chin and then my cheeks, yeah, forehead, and my nose. And my other cheek. Because you guys want to be, make sure you're even. You want to put everything on both sides. Yep, including your hair too. You're going to blend really hard. <laughs> you make sure you get it all nice and in there. In every crease. You switch hands just in case you can't reach the other side of your face. Sometimes I have problems with that, so I had to like switch hands. Yep. My face doesn't tan. Like my arms tan so well, <laughs> <laughs> and like I always have problems with my face tanning. Do you guys have that same problem? I'm just gonna make sure it's all rubbed in with my fingers just to make sure. <laughs> I'm gonna close my eyes just in case. You know, sometimes my hands are a little crazy, so. I'm just gonna put this under my eyes, yep. Yeah. We wanna conceal those dark circles and make sure I do not look tired. I'm gonna do the other eye. Yep. Get it all nice and blended on my mouth. Sometimes I like to inhale it. It really helps get the makeup in there. Get my eyebrow too, because that's important. <laughs> Don't want oily eyebrows, guys. I hate that. That's the worst. Yep, this is beautiful. Right on my cheekbone. Oh. I'm gonna do this side. I'm gonna turn my face a little bit. You know, when you have short, stubby arms like me, it's kind of hard to reach the other side of your face. So. Okay, we got some rosy cheeks going on. I'm gonna put some on my chin and on my jaw and then you just do your nose and your forehead and your eyebrow never miss your eyebrows speaking of eyebrows very lightly oh jesus to my eyebrow <laughs> Sometimes I like to have bold. <laughs> I like to have like really dramatic brows. So this is my eyebrow routine, by the way. Just want to follow this look if you want to get my eyebrows. Just fill it in oh my God. very nicely. So if you can see this eyebrow versus this eyebrow, it is like intense. And we're gonna feel our fur. On <laughs> <laughs> you make yourself look depressed. <laughs> like one of those sad dogs. As you can see, this one is normal. <laughs> this one is going downwards. Because I love having an even eye. Remember, your eyebrows are sisters, not twins. I'm gonna put some down the bridge of my nose. Yep. And then my cheekbones, because I want intense cheekbones. Okay. Yep. There we go. Yep. I like intense highlighter. And also on the dip of my chin. In the center of my forehead. Yeah, Cupid's bow. I almost forgot. And yeah, up there. That works. <laughs> Stop moving! I can't. I can't. <gasps> <gasps> After we draw that contour line. Very nice. Intense contour. Yes. I love it. Um, we're picking the trick shade. And we're gonna put this on my crease area of my eye. Yep. 
and we're just gonna keep putting it there. Uh huh. Yep. You want to make sure you get it all over. Okay. Then we're gonna use YDK and Factory. We're mixing the two shades together. And Nuna. Don't forget the Nuna. And <laughs> trick again. And we're going to put that on the brow bone as a highlight. And the eyelid and eyelashes and eyebrow. Just put it all over basically no matter what. Very carefully. Sometimes I like to go intense with a large wig <laughs> because, you know, I'm going out tonight. So, you know, you have to make sure it is very dramatic and very good. Because if you don't, then people won't notice you. And then no one will like you. Sometimes I like to do an under the eye wing. It's very important. Like, <laughs> this one is, like, <laughs> really great. And we got that one. It's kind of like, eh. But, you know, you can never get your wings even anyway. Put this all over my eye. Now the other eye because you have to get them even. I like to do my mascara with my eyes closed so I don't poke my eye out. You pull, I'm gonna pull it off, I'm gonna twist it up, and then I'm gonna put it on my lips. Hmm. Easy. Yep. No. Okay. Sometimes I like to wear it on my teeth. I like to overline my lips a little bit. <laughs> my makeup is complete. So if you want to get this look, then obviously just follow this look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe down below. All my other links will be linked down below as well. Um, gives this video a thumbs up. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you later. Bye.